Hey folks, I started loving the William Optics Red Cat. It is only like 250 millimeters in focal length and I think 51 millimeters diameter and it is performing at f4.5 and the performance that I have seen so far with the Red Cat is pretty impressive. It does work very well with the ZWO mini guide and I put a color uh, ZWO 120MC color camera. I'm using that for planetary and other stuff. So I didn't actually get a monochrome for this one, but it still performs okay. And uh, it does connect with the uh, Star Arizona filter slider without any extra adapter. I think one thing as in the last video that I was pointing out, you got to ca be careful with the back focus. So after going back and forth, I put a 16.5 mm and a Celestron 7.3 or 7.1 mm. I'll put the link out there, uh, the smaller adapter. I think they are sent. Celestron is selling like three adapters. And I think this is the smallest one in that list. And I put a color camera, the ZWO071 in the back. And inside I have a Optolong L enhanced filter. I've seen so far the performance is very impressive. I still have some stars on, in one of the edges not really right. Since it is only one edge, I'm guessing either one of these connections didn't go really well or maybe my camera sensor tilt. I don't know which one it is, but I'll fix, I can easily fix that in the post processing, uh, but definitely I wanted to check something what it is. And I was talking about these uh, lens shifter. I did check back on Amazon if it is still available. Uh, this particular model is not available, but I did put a link for the other models that was there. And the other question that people are asking about is uh, the counterweight. So this is actually Ioptron 2.2 kgs, if I'm right, or 2.2 pounds. I'll put a link out there for this one. It's pretty neat. Actually, it does work very, very well with uh, Red Cat because it's not much of a weight. So I put a dew heater. It's pretty cold in the night. So I definitely need a dew heater. I wanted to take a picture of the Orion Nebula and when I saw the Red Cat, you know, the field of view, it's huge. So I was able to actually put Orion Nebula on the right and I was able to put on the left side the horse head and it comes in one frame with the ZW071. This is a APS-C sensor, not the full frame, uh, but it does fit. I think if you put a DSLR, I think it does work very well as well. The one good thing with the uh, Red Cat is, you see this thing here, uh, if you make it a little loose, you can actually um, rotate the entire system. So if you didn't get your frame right, you can actually, without touching anything, you can nicely move and uh, put the frame I really like that feature a lot because that way you can position, particularly when you are taking pictures using the wide angle, I think uh, it will work very, very well. Once you are done with focusing, I think make this tight and when you, and this focus is staying all night. So it doesn't change at all. 
uh, just because of the temperature it's not really changing the focus so you can see here it is already uh, plate solved and centered for the image you can see barely the horse head so when you see my settings for the camera I'm using unity gain so this is uh, going to be like gain 90 and offset 20 that's what I'm using. Mm -hmm. 